are you? Oh, hello. Welcome to Red Row Homes at Amington Links. And Where that is in Tamworth maybe? in Staffordshire. And we've got a lifestyle. We have a yeah. lifestyle uh, Warwick. This is definitely the lifestyle. It's I a two bed. It it's actually door, a, two, it's it's a, a two, two bed, bed house, yeah. So it would have been a three, but it's a two. And the whole point of her lifestyle is to provide an ensuite in each room. So what we have are the details for the two different yeah. Warwicks. They We've look got exactly a the same. Three bed, but a Warwick two yeah, bed. Yeah, they look exactly yeah. the same. But mm. we're here to bring you these variants. And to be fair, downstairs it doesn't really seem any different. No. It's when you get upstairs that you notice. Okay, let's, let's start right. looking around. Cloak room. Yeah, that's quite nice. It's got that uh, little window. Very nice corner sink as well. I don't know right. if I saw that, but well, anyway. <laughs> anyway, um, well, let me tell you a little bit about it, the Warwick itself. Is actually an old Red Row design. Been around since the the the, the late eighties. That's when you, it first appeared. It was a beautiful Tudor style house, um, but actually it stood the test of time because it's still here being used all these years later um can i give the viewers some dimensions yeah right four meters 71 by three meters 52. so this is a big what you call a big two bed isn't it yeah. well lifestyle like lifestyle's appearing on a lot of different developments now and it's just it just gives you a just a different option doesn't it these I'm just going back to that sink. Look, oh, there you go, guys. There's that sink. These actually look like my possessions hanging up in the hall there, <laughs> but they're not. I can assure you. Right, let's have a look. So it's covered under the stairs. Yeah, so it's got the alarm, etc. Right. So through to the room of the house, then we've got the kitchen dining. Okay. Yeah. There's the uh, the utility kitchen. Yeah. Right. Let's have a look. Right. Okay. Okay. Right. 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 Okay.
they finish the room off, don't they? Yeah. And then you've got a really lovely size ensuite through there. What they've done is they've taken away the main bathroom. The ensuite is huge. I mean, gosh, that's lovely, isn't it? In the early lifestyle, so you've almost got a kind of wet room feel here, haven't you? Thumbnail, Steve, as I was yeah. saying, they've taken away the concept of the main bathroom in yeah. these lifestyle properties. Yeah. And they've given each of the bedrooms their own bathroom, yeah. their own ensuite. But actually, this is the size of many people's main bathroom. The wet room look kind of started with Red Row, with the, um, the abode collection. I already remember that. Um, I think they're still doing, maybe just ticking them along with them so far. But anyway, you can see outside, the development is well underway. But you can see the guys there putting the foundations in. And But look at that. So this was actually um, originally a golf course. But yeah, you can see, good size room. Bit of the volume in the ceiling poking out there, look guys, as well. Give you a good look at that room, Rob. Right, so you've got bedroom. Oh, sorry, yes, there's your tank and your boiler, yeah. your cylinder. So here is bedroom one, which certainly does feel like a master bedroom. Its dimensions are 3 meters 70 by 3 meters 57. So what they've actually got in here is it's got its own ensuite, which yeah. is a really good size, it's got a bath in there. But you've, where the main bathroom would have been in this house, you've now got a dressing room. So it turns this main bedroom more into a little suite. And this is lovely, isn't it? Yeah, and that's that what typical Warwick I, I love bathroom it. stroke. I um, love that. <laughs> well, oh, you're not sitting in the bathroom. The frosted glass, you mean? Yeah. Yeah. Let's have a look at the glass. Well, you wouldn't want anybody seeing you getting changed, so... So that's a little bit more. I like, you know what I like. I like a walk-in wardrobe. I think it's a, it's a fantastic thing to have. So you've got an ensuite there, bigger than average, I think, with its own bath. We've got ideal standard sanctuary. So it's got a shower and a large shower. Wow, a really super, super-sized shower. Somebody said the other day that Emma interrupts me a lot, and you do. Well, that's what happens when you're married. Right, so you've, we've got a mix up here. We've got ideal standard um, bath, then we've got a satini sink, and then we've got oh, no, then then we've got the lovely wet room there. Look at that with the rainfall shower. Right, they've got a bit of a mix going on, haven't they? Who's the toilet by Russia? <laughs> okay, good room, Very isn't nice. it? Could you live in this? Yeah, I, I think I could. I like red rear houses. Maybe we'll have one of these when we downsize yeah, in a few that's years. It, that's it. Well, thank you for watching. Yes. Um, I really just, appreciate just, it. Just to remind you, this is the Warwick Lifestyle by Red Row. Um, all of the um, measurements, etc., information about this development will all be in the description box down below, so don't forget to check it out, along with a link back to Red Row's own website um, so you can get current information about pricing and availability straight from them and okay. they'll tell you everything you need to know but don't forget to hit the subscribe button and thanks for watching thanks for watching